Well, I'm at the 25th Street Station, R train. Just missed the R train, but it's all right. I get to film around a little more. Uh, for people tuning in and for people who don't know about the train system, the M used to run here, but due to new changes in the system and taking out of uh, two trains, the V and the W, the M now runs from Metropolitan Avenue to 71st Street, Queens. Um, the R here runs local. If you see here, on the cross from me, those holes in the wall there, there's an express track over there which the D and the N run on while the R runs on this line. Um, hopefully we try to get a few announcements on if we get a R one sixty R. But if not, we'll see. Uh, see some people down there. Let's see if I can go get some interviews down there. Well, I'm here at Atlantic Avenue. Uh, transfers here for the BQ two, three, four, and five. The D and the N across the platform here on this track. Uh, so let's take a look at what's happening upstairs. Friends, Dexter no, and Susie. No, no, that's Let's take a look at the debate. <laughs> Keep debating. No, no, Keep debating. No. <laughs> Just blow that face off. No. <laughs> they got the pools done. They plant trees. World Trade One is at floor 42. Trees. They got a plant 400. But anyway, it's a memorial. It's brown. <laughs> it's a memorial. So what do you think they're gonna do now with the E train station now that they're building that memorial? Nothing. What do you mean <laughs> nothing? <laughs> They're just gonna stay, gonna stay like the same yeah. shitty way it is. The though. one train on the other hand, gonna get a nice new look. Really? New walls and shit. <laughs> what about Cortland Street? 
That's what I was talking about. You talking about Corner wait. Street on the one track? That's oh, gonna okay. get news. That's then, gonna be news then, Wait, but didn't Wreck the Street get no hurt no. by it all? That was Court Corner that was Street on the N and the one. I mean the R and the one. Okay. Yeah. But I see that they restored northbound service on the R. So they means they still building on the southbound. The southbound and side is inside the World Trade Center. Ah, I <laughs> see. Okay, and I forgot what line was that that's going under the World Trade Center? The one. The one. Okay. Yeah. Didn't they leave the basement open for? In they no no I'm talking about no I'm talking about a different building. There's a different building that they're making that they're setting up near the ground zero areas. I guess trade one two three four and five. And they left the basement. Basements open in most of the buildings. They can't construct anything yet because they're making the station underneath. So you were thinking it's probably the Century 21 building, but yeah, I think it is. Yeah. Oh, okay, I'm not even sure. That's good. That's good. <laughs> yeah. All right. So now let's get to some basic questions. Um, what do you think is the most consistent line so far? Consistent as in when you get to that station that you don't have to wait long for that train to come. The six. The six train. <laughs> the six. Yes, and I kind of agree with you, especially when I wait by Lexington. A whole lot of stuff. Yeah. All the day of the wedding. The six. Yeah. All right. So and what, by the way, what's your favorite lines? DJ five. The DJ and five trains. Wow. This is you got a whole lot of shit, man. <laughs> What? What? D train is the shit. D train, train is, is the shit. shit. Yeah. J train is the shit. So tell me your true feelings on the new changes that they made, taking out the V and the W, and the W wasn't needed in the first place. Okay. Kind of did, you know. It was just an extra, just like the V train. But still, the V train. Well, actually, no, you're actually, right. Actually, the V train was needed. Because well, the F train going to 63rd, you know, they had to have another line going to 53rd. So, yeah. That's true. The V train, they technically did not really take away. They just combined it with the M train, you know. And I think it's better now, because now the M covers some part, uh, covers Brooklyn now and goes to Queens. It also helps out with the M. If they took out the V completely, that would have caused hell for the E, because the E does have a long route. Yeah, it's kind of ridiculous. I've seen it. Yeah. I'd be lucky to get a seat. <laughs> And what do you think about the new, about what they're doing with the uh, C line as well? Because they're re renovating those R32s and they're putting some 46s on those. I will I tell see. you right now, I will cry when they are gone. Okay, <laughs> no more front window to look out of when you're on the train. <laughs> oh man. What? That front window is the shit. All right. Well, thank you very much, Dexter. Now we have a person. We have a person that did not want it to be put on camera, so we're gonna have this video interview blinded. We don't want to have an ugly picture of Dexter, so we're gonna just point it down to the table while I ask her a few questions, if you don't mind, viewers. Um, most likely, I will just record it and show nice pictures at the same time. Um, but. This is how people's true feelings on train changes and Dexter here is also um, a good friend of mine. He helps me with the trains as well. So in the future, you can contact him. All right, let's see if we can get any other video interviews in the well, meantime. I have another friend named Sakib here. We, um, I'm going to ask him a little bit about trains. Uh, he comes to my school and uh, maybe people are starting to learn about this show, but at least we have some people here that are not afraid for the camera. So let's take a look at Saqib. I'm going to ask him some questions today. Say hi to the yes, camera, Yes, how are you doing, Emmanuel? Yes, I'm doing fine. All right, question one. Um, what is the train that you usually take um, the most? Q train. The Q train. And do you think it's uh, consistent service? It's pretty good, but on Friday, Saturday, Sundays, they close it from Stillville, wherever. Right, so, because of the construction yeah. they're doing, and they're going to stop it at Prospect Park. Yeah. Um, what other train line do you think is uh, consistent? The F train? Uh, I'm hearing a lot of that. A lot of people saying the F. All right. Um, also, do you think any other improvements should be made in the MTA other than the ones that they're doing now? Yeah, clean trains. Clean Cleaner. trains. And what trains are dirty? A lot. <laughs> Mostly Q and M. And Q and the M. And D. And the D. Oh, okay. You should wow. have the camera on him too. MTA. Nazia, if you want to join, come in. <laughs> well, 
Well, I could totally agree with him on the D. Sometimes the D, especially by Bay 50th Street, those trains aren't, trains aren't cleaned up. But MTA try to work on that. But as we can see that the Q and the F, I've been hearing it commonly that it has the most consistent service so far. Um, hopefully that this matter can be changed, but so far, I'm I'm enjoying this. What the hell are you complaining about? You got a fucking car to drive yourself over. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Um, I would like you to also meet my other friend, Andrea. She's um has a few strong points to say. So let's welcome Andrea. Andrea, no, say no, hi. No, no, wait, no. This is live footage. I'm this is live I'm footage. Eating. So then close your food. <laughs> say hi, Andrea. No, not like that. That's violation. No. <laughs> this is live footage, so excuse me. She did say she wanted to be on the interview. Okay, now she's standing behind me. Anyways, these are transit points that are brought forward every day, and randomly generated by myself, and it's exact, true feelings, uncut. So expect anything to happen on this show. Well, from school, my name is Emmanuel Deuces.